Yo, what's going on everybody? Lockout Men back again with another video. Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the Lockout Men podcast show. Yo, I appreciate it. My name is Lockout Men and let me tell you a little bit about me. I am here for the new jacks, the new drivers, the new students, anybody and everybody that's interested in coming into the game, that they have any questions or need any advice, they can always come to this channel and feel comfortable enough that I will try to bring it to them. I am here at the Walmart just waiting for a door. You guys, if if for you veteran guys, because you know you new guys, when y'all get up in here in the Walmart, y'all gonna know what's up. All right, I'm just saying. But for the for the veteran guys that 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 does these Walmart accounts, y'all know what's up. Walmart's not our friend. <laughs> I'm just saying, Walmart, DC, anywhere in the world is not our friend at all. All right, so I am here chilling. I am back to you guys with a new uh, driver spotlight. Um, this is a new series that I that I started recently, and uh, of course, you know. Uh, being that I'm a truck driver, I'm a YouTuber, um, I'm part of the YouTube community of truck drivers and and new feeds come into my feeds all the time. And some of these drivers are very interesting in with the content that they're bringing out. Today's driver we're going to be talking about is Trucker D. And the video that popped up in my live feed is uh, Team Driving. He's 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 been asking he's been asked many a times would he consider team driving. He's been asked many a times in his uh in his con I mean in his comment session or or questions, will he ever team drive and what's his feelings about team driving? Let me let me break it down for you right quick. For me, team driving was a big deal for me when I first started because everybody was telling me at the time, yo, if you do team, you'll make a lot of money. You you get you you get more than uh, more than what you would get solo. The truck would constantly run. Your 34 would be a rolling 34 because when you take a 34, then that other person will be driving. That person when you drive they could take a 34 and they can constantly be out banging them, banging them, banging them. That's what team driving is about. But the problem with team driving is, okay, you have to team with a person that has the same motivation as you. All right. Now, team driving with teams, somebody you should already know. You should already have that buddy that says, yo, let's get in this truck. Let's bang it out. You go home when I go home. I go home when you go home. And then we'll come back out and we'll do it again. Team driving is about getting that money. All right. Team driving with your partner, with your fiance, with your wife, girlfriend, significant other, brother, sister, mother, father. Team driving with them. Now, sometimes that could be that that could cause its own problems in itself. All right, but team driving with a complete stranger, yeah, that's a whole nother can of worms. You know, now, now I, I I got a story. I'm gonna make it quick because I want Trucker D to come in to talk and 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 tell his experience about how he feel about team driving and for trucker d if you guys interested go to his channel uh that's trucker d that's d e e on youtube make sure you guys go follow him because he he definitely has some uh he definitely has some good content on his channel he's a new he's looks like he's a new driver and if i'm not mistaken i do believe that i had a conversation with him I got to go back in the archives to see, but new driver spotlight trucker D uh, quick thing about me teaming. It wasn't with that. I was teaming, but at the little time that I had with my trainer. Yeah, not a good experience. All right, let's go ahead 
hop on to what Trucker D says. You guys, if you guys like interesting content like this, make sure you drop a like. You know what I'm saying? Hook a brother up with a like. It is free. It helps and it works. And it helps for both the channel and the video. All right. Until next time, everybody, when I come back with another driver spotlight, y'all take it easy and I'll talk to y'all later. Peace. What I ever team. What I ever team. I know that's another popular question that I've been getting asked a lot. Um, so we're going to finally talk about that. You know, me personally, I've always been the type of person that said I would never, I would never team. Because just me personally, I've never liked the idea of teaming with a complete stranger, you know, somebody that I don't know now. Would I ever team? Yes. Only if, only if it's somebody I knew and I would have to know how they drive, meaning do they have stamina? Are they clean? Can I get along with this person? You know, if those three things, um, or yes, then you know I would definitely do it. But other than that, I probably would. Now I've always heard that teams, you know, they can clear hundred thousand, hundred fifty thousand plus a year, and I don't doubt it. You know, I've seen. I know you guys have seen the teams: Estes, Triple A Cooper, Sia, Old Dominion. Them guys, they run. You know, now at the company I'm at, uh, we have. Uh, Teams that have, you know, set runs, you know, so you might go from Orlando to Chicago, back and forth, that might be your set run. Or you might run wild. Now, if I was to do teams, because you guys know me, I'm about my money, I would team doing wild. And I say that because you're gonna pretty much go to all the terminals. You know, you're gonna, you're gonna run it up. You're gonna really run it up. Now, I've always been curious to see what those exact numbers are. So, just last night, I was at a truck stop, and I saw a team. They were out of um, Houston. I met up with a Houston team, you know. And, you know, I got to talk to them, and I was asking them, you know, how do you like a team? And, by the way, these are Cooper employees, just like me. I was asking them, you know, like, how do you guys like teaming? You know, how long have you been doing it? Blah, blah, blah. You know, I didn't even ask to see his uh, studs, but you know, when he showed me, guys, when he showed me, <laughs> when he showed me how much he made last year, I was like, God. And I got to thinking, I'm like, so you mean to tell me you guys are out five days, home for two, and y'all are making this much money a year? Man. It made me get to banking. I'm like, man, if only... See, unfortunately, the terminal that I run out of, we don't have teams. We just have teams that come to our terminal to pick up freight. Now, from what I know, we used to have teams out of my terminal, but they got rid of that years ago. Now, of course, if the opportunity ever presented itself, I would jump all over that. Now, I'm sure, you know, my girl, she wouldn't like it, but when she see that money rolling, I'm sure her attitude would change. Just think, just think, guys. You're making well over a hundred thousand dollars teaming now. He was telling me though, it's not easy. You know, teams, you know, they run you. They run you. That truck teaming is designed. You know, the truck is not supposed to stop. You know, it's supposed to keep turning, burning, basically. Now, of course, he was saying, you know, they do get time to rest because sometimes when they go to certain terminals, you know, their um, pups or their van may not be ready yet so he's saying you know that's when they sleep so let me ask you guys my LTL people out there would you guys ever team and if you guys do team you know let me know what company you do it for let me know you know how the money is let me know this type shit have you island last minute trips to the island trip 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 when you slide